We are pushing the boundaries of what is possible through technology. Without it, I would not be able to speak to you today. He was down to about a word a minute. Every time he needed to access his machine, open files, surf the web, all of these actions were very, very tedious because he had to rely on a mouse, which was really very hard for someone who doesn't have an ability to move a mouse. We wanted to build a more open platform that allowed us to really quickly configure and change things so that we're constantly iterating and trying. Bring in different word predictors, bring in different sensors, change the UI, do all of these things by way of just maybe changing XML files rather than doing a lot of coding. The system is written using a Visual Studio, C Sharp. We use standard Windows Forms, .NET 4.5. We also use some WPF and we use the standard uh, Microsoft pluggable framework uh, paradigm to load all the DLLs at runtime. Everything was built around this one actuation mechanism where he uses his cheek to trigger the system. The system responds. And we collected hours and hours of footage of just his face, of him interacting with the system. What was the range of his motion? Uh, did it change with the time of the day? When he was tired, you want the system to trigger, you want the software interface to work. We iterated a lot with him being as a key designer, and the minute he started using it, he would find something. And then he'll come back to us and you know, he'll have this like huge smile on his face. His access to many of the common functions in his machine was about the 10x improvement. Steven was actually quite adamant about open sourcing the system. The nice thing about having such an open platform is that really people from different areas of, of research and development can really make a huge impact. So please help us. We can't wait to see what your contributions will bring to the world of disabilities. I challenge you all here to excel to bring about the changes you want in the world. Keep pushing and never give up. Welcome to Connect.